it was Saturday morning and uh, got the back glass for the old 66 there I got a little bit of a stomach bug I got from my kids I'm not feeling too healthy but let's see if we can't do something for a little while clean up this mess maybe did take the carburetor off and uh, take it back apart I'm not sure that anything was plugged but I know it's clear now so uh, I feel a little better I'll fire this thing up and see how it idles and I broke a nail this is terrible news Good morning, girl. Good morning. Mm-hmm. Well, now it's Sunday, and uh, I'm still a little off my feed. This stomach thing, that one right there, gave me. And uh, we're going to hunt for the trim pieces for the window seals, make sure we got them all, and then order the uh, rubber for the windows, install them, and uh, see what else I'm up to doing today. There's uh, plenty to do. That's good work for a girl. What's this thing in the middle of Florida? Man? It's obviously a part to a flying saucer. Jeff, here comes the lady. She works on a dog. And the rest of us are here. About to get it, mister? <laughs> there ain't nothing up here, chickens. Oh, they think we're feeding them. We're just doing this. We're just shipping them. Hey. Mm, that sounds like big fun. Alright, let's try that again. Still needs a little tuning, but it idles better now. It seems responsive. Well, we didn't get too much done today. Everybody's feeling a little sick, but got to do something. I did uh, take care of a little bit of rust around the window here and sprayed some rust fix on it. And then I clear coated the dash and all its rusty kind of glory. So the glass is ready to put in. I also did the same thing here around the back window. In the roof of the cab so as soon as I get some seals ordered I'll be able to put the glass in it and then I can park the old girl outdoors which would be nice since old blue out there's been suffering under the carport and then this thing still needs a little bit of work I think my spring on the under the primary metering rod is a little too strong you try to idle the uh, this engine doesn't make enough vacuum to pull it down into the jets so I need to modify that other than that I think it'll be okay and that spring I'm speaking of is one of these it goes right in that hole and then your primary metering rods go through the jets and then this fits on top of them and uh, if you got a big cam and it doesn't make very much vacuum, sometimes this will stay up. Pulling those tapered rods out of the jets, making the thing run too rich. This is your part throttle 
circuit. You don't want that working while the thing's trying to idle. These need to be pulled down in. Well, as you can see, I got in the mood for rebuilding quadra jets, so I'm doing another one. Well, I'm getting started anyway. <clears throat> but I'm done for the day. I'm going in. That's it for now. See ya.